The eight-year-old Yazoo City boy shot in the head while playing on his porch remains hospitalized but is now in stable condition. Tonight, 12 News' Anthony Howard spoke to the father of Dylan Johnson in an exclusive interview. Ben Johnson says his son still has some tough days ahead. Well, Dylan is an amazing child that made a large impression on a lot of people. Dylan Johnson's father, Ben Johnson, says Monday night his son was playing outside in his usual spot. He was playing on our back porch in Yazoo City, his safe place, and uh, with not a care in the world. And uh, our house was, was hit with three random shots. One of those rounds struck eight-year-old Dylan in the head. He's, he's stable right now. He, he did have a critical, critical wound. And he's making it through. And he's keeping his head together. Um, and he wants to, and he's fighting. The tragic incident has Johnson calling for something to be done about the nationwide spike in gun violence. Too many people that don't have any sense that have weapons. And that's the problem in this country. It's not about the, all of us who know what to do. It's about the people who don't know what to do and act, and act out on it uh, irresponsibly. So again, here we are, same story, different city, different day, different year, another eight-year-old. Um, I just hope uh, we find somebody for it. According to Yazoo City Detective Nolan Warrington, the police department is looking into potential suspects. Since the incident, the family has received a lot of support from the community. It's been pretty amazing. I'm having to tell people to stop, slow down. I don't need another hamburger. Uh, they're really doing a good job, and they're really coming forward, and, I, and I, we really appreciate it. Um, we put our faith in this hospital because we believe in them, and, um, and they're showing that. According to Johnson, violence has been on the rise in Yazoo City, and now that it's impacted his family, he's lost faith in the community. I'm not hopeful anymore. We're out. I can't wait around anymore. So whatever we were trying to do in that community is, is, uh, is, is not happening fast enough for us. I've done a lot of crying already, and now I think, I think this is anger. I think where I'm me talking to you now is anger and not sadness as much as I've had a lot of that too, but I, now I'm angry. Dylan Johnson is currently being treated at Children's of Mississippi Hospital. In Jackson, Anthony Howard, 12 News.